Earth is never wrong. She knows what she's doing. And so will we if we observe her. Ah! Look me in the eye. And tell me you don't see evil. This show is based on a book called The Mist by Stephen King. On one hand, it's the story of a seemingly innocent mist that one day drifts into the small town of Bridgewell, Maine. And on the other hand, it's a more character-driven story about a family facing its own worst fear when the daughter is sexually assaulted, the parents are torn apart in an argument. My family's at the mall, I've got to get to them. There's a group stuck in the mall, and there's a group that ends up in the church, and then even within there, partnerships and alliances start. What do you want? And then also people's true natures start to come out. The basic functions of a town are no longer working, so the things that you take for granted every day are wiped out. It's like all rules of the norm are out, and you're going stir crazy, and there's not enough food and supplies, and it's like every man for themselves. Pretty soon it becomes clear that whatever is in the mist is not natural, and if you walk out there, you will die. What happens if we're a society becomes ruled by fear? I think it's just such a great metaphor to the world right now. Everyone just gripping with fear and anger. Do you have something to confess? I don't think there's a show out there quite like this one. I think that's the most exciting thing about the show is these sort of like very strange psychological moments. All the characters, especially as you continue in the episodes, are all so fully drawn. When I went out there for you in the mist, I could feel it in every part of me. Once you people see the first episode, they're gonna wanna see more and more. And more. I think that it will be very engrossing for an audience just to follow what happens to all these people in this small town. If you were in this situation, what would you do to survive? 